This video will contain spoilers from the off, so don't be a Tom and moan. You've been warned. Within Succession Season 4, we've seen a decline in the mindset of many of the characters already, and we've only had five episodes. However, one character that's taking a particularly dark turn and drifting into realms that we didn't expect when the season started is Shiv. In the most recent episode, Episode 5, we saw that she went behind her brother's back and sided with the common enemy, Matson. But at what cost? Well, maybe a heavy one. So with that, I thought I'd take a deeper look inside of her mind and explain why she's behaving the way that she is in the more recent episodes. So let's get into it. Here is analyzing Shiv's broken mind in Succession Season 4. Just to let you know, this video will contain spoilers. What's going through Shiv's mind? Well, in the most recent episode, we saw a completely different side to Shiv when compared to what we saw at the start of the season. Right at the start of Season 4, we saw her almost as the head of the siblings when they were looking to set off and do their own thing away from their father. She was leading the conversations that were taking place, standing front and center when it came to the deals that were being made, such as the one for Pierce's, and even in the way that the episodes were shot, she would often be at the front and in the middle of both of her brothers, a stark contrast to what we saw in the most recent episode where she was almost at the side. How it was at the start solidified the confidence and position that she held. Out of the three siblings, it felt like she was actually in one of the better positions. However, now, after flashing forward a few episodes, we've seen her lose her confidence slightly and most definitely her place at the head of the table, and instead is now having to go around the table in order to seek the power that she so desires. By episode 3 of season 4, Shiv was on a different level to the siblings, which was something that wasn't present during the beginning, and that was what made the dynamic instantly change. It made Shiv realize that her mindset needed to be altered and that she ultimately needed to forge a new pathway, one that's providing us the Shiv that we're now seeing in the present. Within her mind, the dynamic change is what triggered it all. She realized that from the moment that she wasn't given responsibility as part of the CE bros and was pushed to the side, despite being told that all decisions and information would still go through her, she saw herself as a lone wolf and would have to just rely on herself in order to keep herself safe from the consequences of her brother's actions, as there was a part of her that didn't trust her brothers. And she was right to think that, as they instantly started leaving her out of meetings, invites, and not giving her the correct information, hiding things from her. Shiv knows power play, and she can be manipulative, like we've seen has been ingrained within the character the entire time that we've known her. And I feel her going behind her brother's backs is her just confirming that she isn't the lamb that can be pushed to the side, but she's instead a wolf, and most importantly, a Roy that can live up to her father's name. The thing that summed this up most and showed that Shiv's mindset was drastically different was the fact that she was speaking with Matson. She had dirt on him which was about the blood that he was apparently sending, but she chose to keep it to herself and not to inform her brothers, the two people who could have done with some information like that, because deep down they didn't want the deal, so they could have exposed it and tarnished his name. But instead, she chose to keep it to herself, allowing her to look out for herself. The smirk at the end of the most recent episode showed that despite not being at the head of the table anymore, she is in more of a comfortable situation than her brothers, and they don't even know that yet. The backstabbing and deceiving of each other is what's going to be the catalyst of the decline of the Roy siblings, and I think Shiv's involvement is going to be large in that. They are all doing their own thing and not informing each other, which will prove to be extremely messy when it comes to it all being revealed. Shiv's Pregnancy There's been a lot of discussion about if Shiv is pregnant, and like was told to us in the episode, she most definitely is. We heard her on the phone to the doctor where they said that she was 20 weeks gone, but the most confusing part about it is the fact that she's keeping it to herself, and it also looked like she was doing some things that wouldn't be good for the baby when she was with Madsen. However, I don't think she actually did. I believe that she was pretending to in order to fit in and for them to be on the same page when communicating with one another, especially considering it was quite a heavy conversation where it felt like the stakes were high. She knew what she had to do in that moment. When she was with Madsen, there were only two occasions where it looked as though she took a sip of her drink, and even still, it didn't seem as though the amount went down in her glass when she put it on the table so she could well have been pretending due to the situation with Matson, in order for her to seem like his equal and to be put on a level playing field. She knows how deals, power plays, and building trust works, so she's almost an expert in that field. They were both playing each other in this scenario. He was playing her in order to see if she would crack and inform her brothers, 
and she was playing him in order to get his trust and forge a good position for when Matson would eventually acquire Waystar and ATN. So it was a power play move, a move that put her on the other side to her brothers and showed the division that was present. We didn't see Shiv tell Tom about the fact that she was pregnant, and it didn't seem like anybody else knew either. She's going through a divorce with Tom, and it seems as though it's definitely not the smoothest ride for either of them. With it seeming as though Tom is more open to being amicable, or at least being more on her side, Shiv doesn't even want to allow Tom inside of her mind for moments of comfort. Even if deep down she feels as though she needs it, we've seen her push him away several times after a short embrace, almost as if she forgets what's happening and the current situation that they're in. They've both hurt each other throughout their time together and they almost treat it like tennis. One hurts the other and then they knock it straight back. Right now it feels as though it's Shiv hurting Tom more, but maybe she's not telling him about the baby because it might not be his. We know that they were in an open relationship, so something could well have happened with somebody else. When she received the call from the doctor, she looked quite upset and in a slightly panicked state, showing that this is a situation that is alien to her. She would rather push it to the back of her mind and deal with the acquisition of Waystar and secure her future in terms of financial stability and position of power, already starting a relationship off with her child in a way that mirrored Logan, business over love, care, and compassion. Shiv definitely has a broken, conflicted mind at the moment, and I would say that she's going through the most when compared to all of the other siblings. She doesn't have the trust for them, she doesn't trust Madsen, and she doesn't trust Tom. She's on her own in one sense, and she's quite literally doing all that she can in order to feel secure herself. Because she knows firsthand how easy it is for a family to betray one another, and she doesn't want to be caught at the short end of things, especially with seeing how things are heading. I think Shiv is going to end up on the other side completely, and with the trailer for the next episode showing that she could potentially be working with Madsen and being somebody on the inside for him, the division is only going to get stronger. It's going to be interesting to see how all of this is going to go, and how it's going to impact Shiv's mentality. So, there you have it, analyzing Shiv's broken mind in Succession Season 4. If you want to see more videos such as Endings Explained, theories and predictions and character breakdowns, then click on the i button. Or alternatively, you can head over to my channel where you'll find them all. If you'd like to give me a show or movie that you'd like me to review, then head over to my Twitter, at BrainPilot underscore, and tweet me what show or movie you'd like me to review next. And finally, if you'd like to see what I rate the latest movies that don't quite make the cut to getting a dedicated video, then head over to my Letterboxd profile. It's where I rate the latest releases in real time. Do you think the character is taking a dark turn? Leave a comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time.